Hello and good morning. Today I'm going to show you how to make hold pits in Unreal Engine 4. It's pretty easy. It won't take you more than 10 minutes and um, it's pretty easy. So make sure you have input, your input in the actor that's supposed to do the stuff you want and then go to macros, add a new one and call it um, hold input. Now you're gonna have two thingies. Now, no, an input and an output. Okay. So you have your input and your output. First, you need to create a sequence. Hold up, I am holding my mic, so it's gonna be hard. Good. Now plug that sequence into the input. Now click on your input and add a new inputs thing over here and call it hold duration and make sure it's a float then you're going to need another sequence plug that into the inputs to the node okay once you got that done Go over to the to these two and rename them. Hold and tap. Okay, now for the good stuff. Go over here and hold G and click. You need two of these. Okay, once you have your two gates, drag them off to the side. And from then zero, you're going to add a delay. Delay. And you pro no, you're going to add a re-triggerable delay. And then from there, you want to plug this into enter. And then one from the same sequence into open. And um, do this if you want to look fancy. Okay. And then add another pin and plug it into open because when you hold or click hold you're going to open the tap input so this can be executed and this can close it actually no. this is the enter and this is the close now plug your duration into your duration who wouldn't have guessed that then do this because you like to be fancy I know you do okay now go over to these you're going to need one more sequence and then you're done plug this into the exit then one close the tap input and then zero triggers the hold input well the hold output call it hold output and from the exit of the tap call it tap output okay that's literally all and to show you the functionality let's get out and bring out our extremely fancy node it looks almost official and plug it into here now set your duration to whatever you want maybe like one second and then on tap, we're going to spawn actor. Actually, no, let's just get current level name. And from there, open level. Plug this 
change the name. And from the hold, we're going to quit game. Good. Now, go over to your template or whatever you're using. I'm using the flying template because nobody ever uses it. And then let's test it out. Space. It restarts the level. Hold space. Oh, not that's all. Hold space. It quits the game. Here you have it. Your hold inputs. So, I know you enjoyed this video. Because obviously you did. So I urge you to subscribe to my channel. Because I need that. I want to make money. And then, I want you to go to, to, to follow me on Twitter. Because if you DM me your problems and whatever you want from Unreal, I can answer you on there. How's that for a deal? Now go and do what I asked you to do. Like, right now. <laughs>